this is going to be another tutorial in the Vegas series, giving you more special effects to dick around with. I'm getting a lot of emails from a lot of people. How do I do this? How do I do that? Eventually, you'll see everything, and you'll be able to make some wicked cool videos. And, you know, go back and look at some of my other earlier tutorials and talks about chroma key and other things. Um, this specific tutorial is going to be about making fast motion, making slow motion, and making stop motion in your Vegas. Sony Vegas is what we're talking about. Sony Vegas editing software. So, it's really, really simple. Really, really simple. And uh, it can be used to great advantage. Just ask Benny Hill. So, uh, without further ado, let's go in. I'll show you on my computer and you'll have it mastered like that. Wait a minute. Like that. How's that? Timing. Most important thing in life. Timing. Anyway, let's go to it. Hey guys, here we go. Uh, this is going to be really easy, trust me. And uh, I'll go pretty quick on this. Okay, as you can see, I've dragged a little raw video clip into my timeline. If I play it... Tutorial in the Vegas series. Giving you more spec... As you can see, it plays in, in normal time. But let's say I want it to play in fast motion. Very simple. Just bring your cursor to the end of your clip timeline and locate the control button on your keyboard. Press and hold it down and you'll see a little squiggly line appear right under your drag indicator. And if you take and hold your mouse button down, click your mouse while you're holding the control button down all the time. And I'll just slide this in. And what I'm doing is I'm, I'm now compressing that video, compressing the time frame of that snippet. So now it's going to play in fast motion. So let's go ahead and play that and see how stupid it looks. Here, and this is going to be another tutorial in the Vegas series, giving you more special effects to dig around. So, a la Benny Hill, now you have a fast motion clip. Let me restore that. Now we'll go to the slow motion effect. Same thing. Just put your cursor on the end of your clip timeline. Hold down your control button. You'll see the squiggly line appear. Click your right mouse. No, I'm sorry. Click your left mouse button and drag the clip and let go. And now we'll have a slow motion clip. Very simple, very easy. Let me restore this. Okay, now let's go to the third sequence we need to learn, which is how to get a stop frame right in the middle of a moving video. I mean, if you can see, I never shut up. Through this whole clip, I'm yakety yakety yakety. But let's say for effect, somewhere in here, I want to get this clip to freeze frame so that I can maybe superimpose some text in over it, whatever the reason. Punctuation, bullet points, whatever. I want to do a freeze frame right there. How do I do it? Okay, this is how I do it, and it's real simple. The first thing I'm going to do is go in here and split the clip right where I want to insert my freeze frame. Now I'll come over here to where this little icon here that looks like a disk. And if I click on that, it's going to save a snapshot of exactly what I'm seeing here onto a file. So if I click on that, a dialog box pops up where I can save a, a, a snapshot. Now I'm just going to save it to my desktop. And this is just, I'm just going to keep it as an image. And you'll see, boom, it all of a sudden it will show up in your project media tab, which is at the bottom 
left of your Sony Vegas, if you click, it'll automatically switch over to that. So you don't have to go looking for it. And you'll see there's the clip right there. I mean, that's not the exact clip. Here it is right here, image three. But uh, I want to insert that, so I'll just slide that over, get my image three, drag it over, drop it in. I'll even resize it a little bit so it doesn't say stay stopped that long, just for demonstration purposes. And of course, you can stretch this or compress it as long or as short as you want. However long you want to be the still frame is how long you make this clip. I'll make it fairly short just to show you how it works. And now I'll come over here and I'll play it and you'll see. I'll be yakking, yakking, then it'll still frame, and then it'll yak, yak, yak. King Human here, and this is going to be another tutorial. Still frame. In the Vegas series. And then it resumes. Very simple, very easy. Now you've got three more things you can do with Sony Vegas. So go out and try and find a way to use those three things in your next project fast frame, slow motion, and still frame. Okay, I hope that explained everything and now you're a master of fast motion, slow motion, and stop motion within Sony Vegas. Now, subscribe to me, King Human, uh, and the reason for this is I'm gonna be doing more tutorials and I get a lot of emails from people asking me questions, tech support, all that kind of stuff. And I don't answer emails from people that don't subscribe. It just, I don't have that much time these days, first of all. And secondly, it's rude. I mean, the least you could do is if you're going to ask me for help, the least you can do is subscribe. So if you don't subscribe, I ain't talking to you. So, at least I'm not talking to you, giving you tech support and spending my time teaching you shit. So anyway, there you have it. Listen, good tutorial coming up. The next tutorial is going to knock your socks off about making cool animated lower thirds and a cool animated logo set that you can use to really make your YouTube videos stand out. It's wicked cool. All right, people, King Human out of here. Be cool. Sayonara.